I need a haircut. My bangs aren't even bangs anymore. They're like in my face -ness. Like those aren't bangs. Those are in my face. In my face. Hi guys. So, um, wow. I am. I am just so overexcited today. I don't even. What? Few things that I want to talk about. On Monday, I ordered my Kat Von D palette from Sephora, and it came in last night. So I'm going to be talking about that. And I also went to Sephora today because I'll I'll, I'll explain that in a, in a minute. Now I'm going to talk about my Kat Von D palette, and I got ooh, um what is it True Love? Sorry, I carried it backwards. <laughs> I got True Love. And it is a special edition, that's why it's like purple. This is just the box, by the way, if you're wondering. Um, so it's purple, the thingy, because it's special edition. That's why I got the purple one. I was just like, why is the purple one so appealing to me? Duh, because it's purple. So you're probably like, oh my god, open it, show us the damn eyeshadows. So here they are. And really, like looking at this on my um camera the colors looking at them on camera do nothing for what it actually looks like in person like on my camera th these look kind of gray but this is like a bright purple that stinks my camera sucks okay more thing um since this is a special edition it comes with a cream eyeshadows but i mean one cream eyeshadow but you probably already heard that before but i just figured i'd tell you anyways um so this one is peanut um, just like a nice nude color and then this is Benji which is the cream color and then this is Rebecca Rebecca <laughs> and then Lucifer which comes with every Kat Von D palette and Cholita which is like a it's like a dark purple like it looks kind of brown but it's like a brown purple if that makes any sense um, this is Sheba, which is an, also a dark purple with like gold flecks in it. The camera really does nothing for it, but the gold flecks make it really pretty. And then this is, um, Babe, which is like the main purple, and it's kind of like pinky purple, kind of, I don't know. Um, and then Missy is really cool because it looks white in the pan but when you put it on it has like a purple like shimmer duochrome thingy majig bob going on <laughs> majig bob um <laughs> so yeah those are the colors i took my little thingies out they go in here and i figured if i'd hold it up they just fell out like that anyways let me just let me just rant about this for a second this is something that i just i don't understand a whole like all these palettes they, they come with like sponges and sponge applicators these ones aren't sponge applicators they're like real brushes but this this is tiny what like look at this next to my eye like th no this would take a billion years if i tried to put eyeshadow on with this little thing and look how short it is it's like why do you even bother to spend money on these to put in your palettes when people who get the palettes are just gonna throw them away like these are going in my damn trash can right now like what am i gonna what am i gonna what's ridiculous like go in the trash i do love this palette um i also love how it, it's kind of it's kind of heavy i think it's just because of the mirror um it's like, I like how it's like matte black and the design on it, it's just, feels so nice. I'm a dork. Okay, the order from Sephora. Oh, another thing that I got from Sephora. Why am I like not including this? I got the um, Kat Von D, um, what's it called? Concealer, but I'll talk about that in a second. So, um, to be honest, I swatched these like they swatch pretty good on your finger like that's like one swipe on the purple one but I when I put them on and I have I used my um, Urban Decay Primer Potion I really had to pack the color on like I, I'm use I use my Kat Von D palette for this look today I was kind of bummed out about that because um I was putting it on and it just kind of looked really sheer I didn't use the cream eyeshadow I suppose if I use a cream eyeshadow um underneath it then yeah, I'll probably try that and see how it goes. But just for just for the base and with the eyeshadows, I was kind of disappointed. The black shows up really good, and um, this color, the dark like purple brown color, shows up really good. Um, but just like the purples, it was really 
kind of disappointed that for the Kat Von D um, concealer. Um, I got light because I have really dark under eye circles and it's horrible. It's been a problem ever since I was little. So I really wanted to cover that up and what better than the tattoo concealer. Um, and the consistency is really nice. It's really creamy. It blends well. Um, it has a nice coverage, but at the same time, um, if you want like full, full, full coverage, you need to like dab it instead of rub it, which you need to do with most concealers. Um, I don't know how in the hell this is supposed to cover up tattoos, like black tattoos. You would be sitting there forever freaking dabbing this on you to cover your tattoos. I what? I was expecting it to be like this crazy, insane pigmentation. You know, oh my god, if this can cover tattoos, and this can cover everything. Blah, 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 blah. Honestly, I don't understand how this can cover tattoos. If you can make this work to cover your tattoos, more power to you. What am I doing wrong? Like, please tell me, because I have to pack this shiznit on if I want to cover a damn tattoo. I mean, I like it. Um, I just used it this morning, so um, I'd have to um, use it a couple couple more days, maybe a week or so, to actually full-on tell you if I love it or hate it. But for my first, um, my first impression, I don't know how this is supposed to cover tattoos. Like... That's just my personal opinion. So when you order from Sephora, if you spend over $50, you get free shipping. So, um, this was $34, I believe. Don't quote me. I, I don't remember. And I forget how much this is. I'm sorry. I don't remember. These two together was over $50, so I got free shipping. And, um, you also get to pick three free samples. So, what I picked was the Urban Decay um, D Slick in a Tube Majig, and it's supposed to be like a mattifying um, cream, which I'll talk about that in a second. I also got Stila One Step Makeup, and then I haven't used this yet, but it's like Clinique, um, something about covering up redness. But first of all, for the D Slick, I was very impressed. To be honest, it takes a lot to impress me, and I was very, very impressed with this. I was just like, Ooh. I used it this morning, and I put it on before I put my powder on, because I just used powder today, because um, I was supposed to go to the Apple store with my dad, and so I just threw some powder on. Um, but I put this on beforehand, because I didn't want to bring powder with me to reapply, so I just figured, hey, I'll use this, and see how it goes. And I love, like, you, it feels, like, oily. Like, I put it in my hand, and I'm like, there's no way this is going on my face. I'm like, I, I'm just going to run to the bathroom and wash this off if this doesn't work out well. But I put it on, and all of a sudden, it just, like, gets dry. Like, I can't even explain it. It was just amazing. It was amazing. And I have been using my, where is it? My MAC, my mat from MAC. And this makes, even it makes you look matte, but you feel oily. This makes you look matte and you feel dry. So, yeah, I think I'm going to go with this one. I went to Sephora today because when my dad went to the Apple store, there was Sephora nearby. So, I got my D Slick because I loved it so much and it's amazing. Like, so much better than matte. And then what else did I do today? <gasps> I got this jacket today. It's amazing. I'll be back. I gotta show you. I have to. I have to do it. So this is my awesome jacket that I got. Like, look at how sweet this is. I was so excited about this. Yep. My sweet jacket. Oh, I love it. I can't wait till school starts. I can't wait till the fall and it gets cold here so I can wear my jacket. But... Yeah. So, other than that, that's pretty much it. Um, just wanted to tell you about my Kat Von D palette and my goodies that I got today. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully, if some are coming soon. I don't know. Maybe in the near future. <laughs> just kidding. Okay, bye.